is a dupec 323 here and um like i said in uh, my last video that i would uh give you guys uh of uh unboxing for the kingdom chaser so let's get started well somewhat of an unboxing i already opened it just got a little anxious i couldn't i couldn't wait any longer so here it is this is just uh this is the box here it doesn't come in like a case or anything like uh tpx or anything does it's kind of bad but it's it's a good box all right so what you'll get on the inside is okay uh you get your barrel plug yeah can't get it out all right you'll get your barrel plug and uh i put in a uh, rubber band on mine attached to my gun because it's just easier uh get some paint I already shot some of it so you'll have a lot more than this uh, you'll get two CO2, CO2 cartridges and uh, so under this gun right here this is uh, the Kingman chaser obviously um, 11 mm millimeter or 43 .43 cal uh, paintballs go into here as you can see these are a lot smaller than like and these paintballs are a lot smaller uh, so yeah this is a gun I shot it before before like I made this video and uh, it shoots really well it shoots really accurate accurate I haven't chronoed it because I don't have a chrono with me so uh, yeah tomorrow I'm going uh, tomorrow yeah tomorrow I'm going paintballing so I'll get out some videos actually after this unboxing right after this unboxing there's gonna be a quick clip of uh, me playing or my brother playing uh, with the Kingman chaser so it should be good right there uh, then you would get your squeegee obviously this squeegee is really not that good you just feel it from like touch it's not really like too rubbery it's more of like a hard kind of plastic um, so what I would recommend is you get like take this swab that's in here and put it loop it through here, which I'm pretty sure they made that loop there specifically for that. So you could just do that and then swab it through, cause yeah, you're not gonna get a good clean with just this. So it's good. Uh, in here you get your Allen keys, the only Allen keys you need. Then you get this switch hold on let me get that out ah. all right so you'll get some you'll get this this is uh i forgot what it was called but it's the basically the rail that goes across from your uh from one side of your gun to the other where the one side where the air comes in and where the, pi the little piston is and goes to the other side of your gun where the or the actual, the other piston, right? It's it's gonna be like something like this. Can't really explain it, like of what it does, but it basically when this so when the piston in here moves, that moves in with it. So these two are basically connected. These two sides are basically connected inside there. So you have to have that basically. So that's just an extra one. Uh. Some Allen keys, O-rings. This is what I want to take out. Alright, right, this. This you're gonna. This uses what you're gonna need to basically uh, take it apart. We'll take some of it apart. Right back here is where you're gonna need it, and you're gonna have to put it in there, like cock it. It. and then right here where you're gonna see this kind of silver kind of bar thing you put that in there and then you twist it and you twist it and it'll unlock and then your whole bolt will just come out I don't really want to do that right now cuz yeah just it's working fine so I don't really want to take it apart 
make sure like so it works definitely for tomorrow and uh that's basically it it's just the basic marker itself i ordered a different uh kind of like package kind of deal and mine yeah mine came with 20 co2 cartridges you can hear them there's a lot of them in there 20 uh what else it came in this box this is really irrelevant doesn't really matter it's just the box right here is the the strap that i bought for it i'm not sure oops sorry i'm not sure how this is gonna work too well it's gonna work good or not right here here you'll have your uh, pods, your little 10 round pods. These are made for 68, uh, .68 cal, but I'm going to use them for the chaser. And they work really well too. I just have to cut down the size, because these used to be about, I don't know, up to here. And those wouldn't fit into here, so I couldn't lock it. So I just cut that off, just, just so the cap could hold on, just enough for the cap to hold on right here. Right about there. I'm gonna cut it. And, uh, yeah, now it fits perfectly, so. That's good. And then over here, on one side, I, the two extra mags that I got, I got separately with the gun. It didn't come with a package, so I bought them separately. I recommend you actually get, uh, extra, extra mags. Wow. Um, extra mags, because you're probably not going to last uh, with just one mag alone, so I always recommend that. Two mags here. Uh, the CO2 cartridges, they hold, they get, uh, they're held with this kind of rubbery, not rubbery, it's kind of rubbery, but it's obviously like threaded and everything. So you just basically just pop it out, it's easy. There's nothing difficult about it. So while you're in game, it'll be easy to get to. Just clips. I have a really like skinny waist, so this works well. This works really well right here. I got the CO2s and then the, this in the bag the pods and the clips. Clips right here. And goes around and what I am thinking of doing for the game like when I'm playing is to just uh, like the pre-game or whatever pre-game but uh, like in the save zone instead of uh, just like holding it in my hands constantly you could just simply just like put it in here it's not gonna be like the snuggest fit but it'll just hold it for now like until I buy uh, an actual uh, uh, thigh strap. So until I buy that. So, it's gonna work well, hopefully. And, uh, I'll give you guys a quick clip of, uh, of me playing, me and my brother playing, uh, at Battle Creek Paintball NJ in New Jersey. And, uh, yeah, so, see ya. Peace. Dubik 323, signing off. <laughs> I see him. We got one on, on Yeah, yeah, I see him. He's at the pop out a little more. Yeah. He's blind fire, I thought. Oh, I guess that's
I'm gonna move right there, so cover me, right? He's 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 pointing his head out, so shoot right now. Shoot. Go, go, go. Shoot. He's laying down right there. Here. Down? Yeah, he, right here, if you look over here. I can't okay. shoot that far. Right here. Just be careful because he might be shooting. Right here and he'll be laying down on the floor. Just peek over there. He's hiding behind a tree now. Do you see him? Players out! I can't peek out, they keep shooting. Behind the tree. You got, yeah, I'm Where am I at? Am I, am I clean? Paint check. I gotta reload, I gotta reload. Come friendly, friendly!
Double kill! What's up guys, uh, click the link on the left to go to my channel, click the link on the right to see some extra footage from that day. See ya.